Tonight, Motor Officer Ty Lenahan's family was at the vigil, surrounded by community members, some who knew him personally, others who simply were grateful for his service and sacrifice. Tonight, they shared stories of what this officer meant to Elk Grove. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. Remembering Officer Ty Linehan. So Ty, thank you for being the light for us. His life cut short in the line of duty. It's Ty epitomized having the heart of a servant. Leaving his family in the dark shadows of grief. We also recognize through darkness that light will emerge. And the only thing that drives out darkness is light. But in the warmth of each flickering flame Thursday night, several dozen Elk Grove community members wrapped the Linehan family in comfort with each story of how he impacted their lives. He's going to be missed. Whether they worked side by side and considered him a brother. And if you ever saw him riding around and you saw his infectious grin on his face as he went by and cracked some little joke at you and looked at you and said, are you serious? Or would just sometimes run into him at the coffee shop. So he noticed I was just really having a rough go at it at the beginning of COVID and he buys my coffee. And I say, dude, I, I should be buying your coffee. And he says, no, no, no. You know, you're the one who needs it at best. Even those who didn't know him at all, but knew he was someone who would show up if needed. He kept us very safe. But in many ways, they say Officer Lenahan's light hasn't dimmed. Carolina Vargas was a mentee of his through the Galt High School Explorer program. She said his humor, kindness, and dedication to serving his community changed her life. But for him bringing me out of my dark shadow, dark shell, it's like, you know what, I'm going to keep that promise that I made with you of becoming a police officer like you. And she says his legacy will continue to shine bright. Really such a somber and emotional evening. Now, the public is also invited to attend Officer Linehan's memorial service. That takes place on Tuesday at the Bayside Church Adventure Campus in Roseville starting at 10 a.m. First day of a public viewing for Officer Linehan. It's happening at the Green Valley Mortuary and Rescue. Keep in mind, Linehan was killed by a suspected DUI driver last Friday on Highway 99. Linehan had been with the Elk Grove Police Department for six years. The viewing will continue tomorrow from 3 to 5 p.m.